Hello everyone, it's me JB from Inec Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you 5 best free keyboard apps for Android and iOS. So, without any further more delay, let's begin. So, if you are using a Android device, then just go to the Play Store. And if you are using a iOS device like iPhone, then just go to the App Store. So, you will find a similar applications which I am going to show you right now in this video so right now I'm using an Android smartphone as you can see the home screen of my Android smartphone so on the first list we have the Gboard keyboard so just open the Play Store and in the Play Store just search for application name as Gboard as you can see on the first list Gboard the Google keyboard so Gboard is from the Google itself so this Gboard is inbuilt in my respective Android smartphone so you want to see here open so if you have not downloaded and installed this then firstly download and install it and after that on launching you can see this kind of user interface as you can see in the below this kind of UI that is a user interface and tons of options and you can see here will separate like icons just tap on it then it will take you to the settings phase you can go to the preference to do a lot of settings depending upon your needs if you want to enable a sound on the key press you can see here sound on key press you can enable this or you can disable this you can get a lot of options and here you can get a teams also if you want to select a different colors and different teams for your respective layouts and here you can get one very useful features like a clipboard so just click on the clipboards and if it is not enabled just turn on this options so that whenever you select or copy any text or image pictures it will be directly shown to you here's here when you go here you can see your clipboard options so very useful keyboard applications from the google so definitely a cool keyboard applications that you should try it out on your respective devices now on the second list we have the Microsoft Sweep keyboard. So once again open the Play Store and in the Play Store just search for the application name as Microsoft Sweep key. As you can see on the first list Microsoft Sweep key keyboard just tap on it. As I have already downloaded and installed it so I am not going to do it again. So you firstly download and install it after that just tap on open. Now it will give you some instructions how to enable it just tap on the enable Sweep key. Just enable the swap key. Click on OK. Now select the swap key as your default keyboard. Click on Finish Setup. Now it will ask you some instructions, so I will just click on Not Now. So you can see here it's asking some permissions. I will just click on No. Installation is successful. Now you can see here some settings options. So like before you can set your own teams galleries yours and custom layout so here are tons of galleries you can download for yourself you can you, you can create your own custom layouts so you can see a lot of options here so I'm not going to discuss you to make you bored here so you can check out all the options that is available under this keyboard so you can see below here a floating blue icon right a keyboard icon can see here the layout how the layout looks so you can see here very minimalistic design or the material UI looks you can see so you can get a swipe style everything and you can just type whatever you like so almost a very simple looking keyboard and it has a swipe features also you can just enable it by going in the options itself so definitely a good keyboard application that you should try in your respective devices now on the third list we have the Plexi keyboard so once again open the Play Store and in the Play Store just search for one application name as Plexi as you can see in the first list Plexi free keyboard just tap on it like before I have already downloaded and installed it so you firstly download and install it after that just tap on open now it will give you some instructions what to do just tap on activate Plexi key now just enable the flex key click on ok now select flexi now you need to select the flexi as default 
keyboard application so you're all done you can click on skip on the right bottom now you can just try flexi now so you can see here the user interference and you can see your three dot icons on the left side and you can go to the teams or select options so you can go get search settings looks how you want to looks by going or selecting your own team so it is also very minimalistic and if a good thing is that you can customize this keyboard too depending upon your needs so i'm not going to discuss much about what are the features inside it's going to provide so you can find out what are the options available inside this application by yourself so definitely a good keyboard applications too that you should try it out by yourself so on the fourth list we have the type wise keyboard so once again open the play store and in the play store just search for one application name as typewise as you can see on the first list typewise custom keyboard like before i have already downloaded and installed it so you firstly download and install it then after that just tap on open now it will give you some instructions how to activate it just tap on activate just enable the typewise click on ok click on ok now just select the typewise as your default keyboard now you can see here you can just see the settings options different layouts how you want to select the layout so here is one team which you will definitely find unique as you can see the default which is selected as a hexagon right so below you can see a tons of options so i'm not going to discuss much about the options what it provides so let us try using this so let me open a browser and just let me show you the user interface of this keyboard so you can see this hexagonal theme looks very unique and it's rarely seen on most of the keyboard applications so you can see here so you can just use a mouse cursor like effects and you can see here totally looks different so it's very useful if you want to use it with the uh, two hands so definitely a cool looking keyboard applications that you should definitely try it out on your respective android and ios devices so on the fifth list we have the grammarly keyboard so once again open the play store and in the play store just search for one application name as grammarly so you can see on the first list Grammarly keyboard just tap on it like before i've already downloaded and installed it so you firstly download and install it and after that just tap on open on opening the application it will show you some instructions just tap on get started so it will ask you to sign up but don't worry you can use it without the signing or creating account you can see on the right bottom below not now just tap on it and now just tap on add grammarly keyboard now just enable the grammarly keyboard click on ok click on ok now you can see your swipe input methods just tap on it just tap on grammarly now you can see our uh, themes options that is a uh, light and dark theme and if you want to enable the uh, key borders you can just enable it to make it more modern and if you just want the numbering rows in the keyboard just enable it just enable and just click on which team you like you can continue with the light team or the dark team depending upon your needs just tap it and click on done so we are completely done so let us test it how it looks so let let us enable this so you can see this kind of is different so looks almost similar with the google keyboard or the gboard so you can just swipe it so it has a swipe feature so i'm not going to discuss much options here also so you can just go to the settings of the swipe so you can see your keyboard customization so you can get some options to customize you can just go to the options of settings and you can just customize depending upon it and a good thing about using this application is that if you're a guy who is in a need of grammarly words corrections then you can use this keyboard which will solve all your grammar mistakes whenever you type any words or text in your respective 
Android or iOS device. So it has a good features which will be useful for those people who are very grammar righty versions then you can definitely try this grammarly keyboard applications on your respective android and ios device so definitely a good and useful keyboard to try it out by yourself so these are the five best free keyboard apps for android and ios device that you should definitely try it out on your android and ios devices so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching